This is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm showing you a really cool video and that is how to set up a new screen with the My Magazine UI UX uh, for the Galaxy Pro series. So this is how you set up a new screen. When you hit a new screen, you tap it and then you get to choose what you want as the categories. So this is the, this is the new section category. So if you are into, say, technology and other things, you can put that. I'm just going to put technology for this one. All of your social networking ones will be here, so Google+, Facebook, and all of your rest of your social. Over here we have applications. So here's where you can put bookmarks, contacts, emails, favorite apps. That's one I'm going to put right there. Just tap it and it'll add it itself. You can put frequently used. So these were the ones that you frequently use. Uh, gallery, uh, office on here. You can put your S planner, messages, apps, and uh, it adds on. So as you put apps here, it'll keep adding them. You can think of these kind of like live widgets or uh, tiles, uh, it's kind of a mixture really. And uh, let's put gallery as well. And I, I wonder how many we can add here. Um, outside of your hands. So can we add one more. Trust the make sure that only Yep, so we were able to add to six. Yeah. So we've added the maximum amount we can, so now we're gonna hit done. And this is our new screen that we just created. Over here on the favorite apps, you can actually tap this and then add your favorite app. So you can add up to eight total. It'll be four squares and then another four. So just to quickly show you how this works. We have now a total of eight and here we have it here. So you can't scroll this one, but you just tap it right here and then it goes to your other four. So really nice uh, way to set up the new device and looks really good. So this was how to set up a new page on the new uh, on the new uh, MX or sorry UX for magazine magazine UX for the Samsung Galaxy Pro series. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. It's been R C K Y, the Android guy.